Hi everyone, thanks for joining me today at Almani's Library. We're going to be reading Bluey's Camping. If you have a copy, run and grab it so that you can read along with me. This book of Bluey is called Camping, based on the TV series Bluey. The healers are on a camping trip. Bluey wants to build a stick house with Bingo, but Mom has other plans. Bingo's coming with me, Mom says. She hasn't had a bath in three days. So off Bluey goes to the creek, alone. As Bluey searches for sticks, she hears a voice. Bonjour. Hi, my name's Bluey. Salut, Bluey. Je suis Jean-Luc. Bluey doesn't understand what Jean-Luc is saying, but that doesn't stop them from building a stick house together. Oh, c'est très beau. Now we need some food to eat, says Bluey. We can plant this seed like farmers. This will grow into a big tree with fruit on it. But it might take a while, she adds, and we need something to eat now. Suddenly, they hear a howl coming through the forest. Hide, shouts Bluey. Snuff, snuffle, snort. It's a wild pig, Bluey says. Sanglier, says Jean-Luc. Bluey and Jean-Luc make a plan to capture the wild pig, but he escapes. Never mind. Ha ha, hee hee. Bluey, dinner, mom calls. Then Jean-Luc's dad calls to him. Jean-Luc, dinner. See you tomorrow, Bluey says. They both run off to their families. Good night. Bon oui. The next morning, Bluey and Jean-Luc are ready to play. Jean-Luc, bonjour. Hmm, no fruit tree yet. We need a better plan to catch that wild pig or we will have no food for the winter. I've got an idea, Bluey tells Jean-Luc. My dad taught me how to do this. Bluey scares wild pig. Wild pig runs away. Jean-Luc jumps out. Hooray! They wait until they hear the wild pig roar, and then... Ah! It's time to head back to camp for the night. Goodbye, Jean-Luc, says Bluey happily. See you tomorrow. No, Bluey, Jean-Luc calls. Au revoir. The next morning, Bluey discovers that the seed they planted is growing into a little tree. Jean-Luc, come quickly, Jean-Luc! But she can't see Jean-Luc anywhere, not at the campsite. Jean-Luc? Or at their stick house, Jean-Luc! Bluey runs back to Mom, who tells her that Jean-Luc must have left. His holiday is over. What? says Bluey. You mean they're gone? I'm afraid so, sweetheart. That night, while Bingo has a bush wee, Bluey asks Mom why Jean-Luc had to leave. Sometimes special people come into our lives, stay for a bit, and then they have to go, says Mom. But that's sad, says Bluey. It is, says Mom. But the bit where they were here was happy, wasn't it? Yeah, we caught a wild pig together, Bluey says. Maybe that makes it all worth it, says Mom. Will I ever see him again? asks Bluey. Well, you never know, says Mom. The world's a magical place. Hello, Bluey. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe and like so we can read together again. Let me know what book you want to read next in the comments below. See you next time.